lights on. Uh, the two most fashionable people in the world enter the room yet again. These are our Met Gala reviewing outfits. Outfits. This is these are our reviewing Met Gala outfits. 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 Yeah, that's what I meant. Yeah, that's what I meant to say. Yeah. And uh, I think we did pretty damn well. This is, I hate this outfit. <laughs> like I actually do. I just came straight from work, and now we're working again. Because we never stop working, and that's the life of a of fashionista. A fashionista. It is. It is. And That's so, true. Fashionistas are literally always working. Yeah. Also, we got a lot of DMs from people yeah. wanting us to do this. So. Yes. And so here we are. We're doing it. Be- because we want to, but also because you want us to. And so let's just jump right in. Here is the most important fashion review of the 2021 Met Gala. Oh, was there a theme, by the way? Yes. What's the theme? American independence. Okay. First up. First up, we have... Lupita Nyong'o. And, I mean, yeah. I like it. I love the, the denim. You know, very American. There's denim on that? It's, it's literally made out of <laughs> The whole thing is, she's wearing jeans. Yeah, fancy jeans. But she's right. I mean, like, denim is so American. She's wearing one jean. Yes. She's wearing one leg of jean, but as a dress. Exactly. One and it's like pant be- leg. This is like, but it's like when you get new jeans, but you still have to get them hemmed, but you're yeah. like too lazy to do it, so you wear them anyways. <laughs> yeah. And then it's just fucking like this. Right. You know, you're at the bar. Right. With 16 feet of jean behind you. <laughs> Quick side note. Like, I think every year when we do the Met Gala, people are like, they, but they didn't meet the theme, or like, listen. There's two average Joes, I don't okay? care. We I don't, don't care. I don't know. I don't know about that. We I don't know, know that anything there's a theme, themes or and anything. I think that's awesome. Some people I think look good regardless of the theme, yeah. and some people I think look bad regardless of the theme. And some anyway, people, and some people wear jeans, yeah. and that rhymed. Let's move on to the next one. Ella Emhoff. Oh, that's she, Kamala Harris's stepdaughter. That's cool. She kind of looks like just you know, she looks like she went to like a fancy aerobics class or something. Yeah, she looks like, like she a could gymnast. be like a, a, a gymnast. Yes, but I also think she looks like. Someone at the gym that does a little bit too much. You know, you see someone at the gym and they're wearing like, you know, they, they're just wearing like a crazy matching fit. You have just like something in your tooth. Sorry. I was saving that. I get that. I think she kind of looks like, she kind of reminds me of like a character on Step Up. Like I feel like she's going to like do a good dance routine. Yeah. I like the matching sneaks. What do you think she was going for? Peloton instructor. <laughs> oh my God. Like Peloton instructor's <laughs> night out. Yeah. Absolutely. Yes. Yes. Yeah. yes. That's perfect. Yeah. Yeah. That's perfect. Which very American. Very American. Yep. 10 for 10 on the American so far. Oh, okay, here's Lil Nas X. Now, I have seen a lot of these outfits. I don't know if Cody has. He was trying to like savor his viewing until this. I I mean, I it's like you can't avoid it. He's like yeah. all over Twitter. So it's this, every single picture. He is a master, a master of getting of, people to talk about him. Yes, of being seen. He and, he woke up one day and he said, "Let's give him something to talk about." And he's done that. Can you sing it with me? Let's, Let's give him something, something to talk about. Why don't you want to sing that? I don't feel a little bit shy. Okay, so he he started out, and he was wearing the robe. Okay. He felt a little bit shy too. Yeah, he was a little. <laughs> and then here. bow. That scared the shit out of me. Sorry, but I mean that's that's I feel like he, the, it went the from robe to bow, but then so it went robe. It was at this. <laughs> it's not like this is an understated <laughs> robe though. So he went robe to bow to cool street performer. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> They're like, is he looking at me? And he goes with this. They're like, little Nas X, little Nas X, right here, right here, right here. He's like. <laughs> that was really good. Thank you, Mechel 2021. This one is hot figure skater as well, kind of. Yeah, it is. Um, like, the guy looks good, you know? You'd think that the theme so far was figure skater, but it was America. I saw someone that was like, I fucking hate these shoes. And it's like, they're kind of just black shoes, you know? I don't mind them. I don't mind them. I think he looks cool. This is absurd. Yeah. Like, this is a Halloween cast- costume. Yeah. Because he looks like he's C-P-3PO. I don't know. Bit, it's so. kind of like sexy C-3PO. C-3PO went to Vegas. Yeah. You know, and put some jewels on. Yeah. Fair. I kind of think it's hot. Ciara. I have like a big bone to pick with this one. <laughs> it's like a football? Yeah, so that's her husband's like football jersey. Oh, okay. Like I get it. Like American <gasps> football. It's a big thing. Oh. It doesn't have to be so on the nose. Yeah, that's what, that's what I was Absolutely. looking Absolutely. Sorry, I'm There's just like, dead. it's like you can still be Sierra representing football, which your husband plays. Instead, you just dressed up as your husband. <laughs> And I just, there's just something I just don't love about it. Does he play for the Seahawks? Yes. Okay. It's Russell, um, 
Oh, Russell. No, not Russell Westbrook. Wilson. Russell Wilson. It's so, like I totally get it, and I and I appreciate it. It's just a little too on the nose, you know. Yeah, I agree. She doesn't need to be dressed up as her husband. <laughs> Sometimes I wish I did act like you gotta, a boy. You, it's like like if this was Halloween, that'd be like a sick costume. Yeah. <laughs> Kristen Stewart. I kind of I kind of like this. I had a like my hairdresser, hair cutter, hairdresser, my stylist. No. My the the woman who cut my hair growing up. She was okay. in a rockabilly band. She played stand up bass. Okay. And she was very this, and it kind of reminds me of her. So that's kind of sweet. I didn't know anyone that was in a rockabilly band, so for me, I don't like it. Is it cash? It's not jeans. I you know I guess I guess that's true, and I like the hair. Maybe she maybe maybe I absolutely love it. <laughs> <laughs> Rosalia. I feel as though she's always wearing something similar to this. What no? is, I, don't I don't know. I feel like the last time we talked about her, she was in something similar. It's leather. It's leather. Yeah, I mean, that is a lot of leather. That seems like it'd be warm. Warm, and then like the fringe is kind of just like getting all over the place, you know? Like it's kind of getting in between your legs, getting, like while you're walking, it's like wrapping around you. Uh, Excuse me. Yeah, the caption says, I hope she doesn't plan on getting on any escalators, which I think is very funny because picturing that. Her getting like stuck. Yeah, and just like slowly like, oh God, no. But like she looks good still, obviously, you know. Lily Rose Depp. Lily Rose Depp. I love. I love that. It's super Y2K. Yeah, it is. Okay. Yeah, I get it now. And I think that that's cool. I get it now. Y2K prom queen. Who is Lily Rose Depp? Johnny Depp's daughter. That would make sense. They do have the same name. Dan Levy. What is this? This one's pretty insane. I like the message. It's um pretty intense. Yeah. Like um visually. Yeah. It's like initial. Like I mean, just like all the colors and the maps, and it's hard to like wrap your head around at first. Yeah, I mean, you know, people. A lot of people this year, you know, had some sort of message. Just fashion wise, when the, when I just scrolled to this, I was like, ah. But then once you like kind of look more at it, you're like, oh. So it's like love is love all over the world. That's what I'm thinking. The whole world. Yeah. Love is love. Uh, that's what I think, which I agree with. Yep. We've well, got big wings. He does. He kind of looks like an angel. All right. Kim Petras. Kim Petras. <laughs> it's just so unnecessary. It's so unnecessary. It's just like that filter on TikTok. Yeah, that like turns you into. <laughs> she should have taken. A, she should have done a TikTok in this dress. Yeah. And then she could have. She would have been a horse mm -hmm. inside of a horse. Whoa. I'm kind of like a converted guy now in terms of horses. I'm yeah. a fan of horses now. No, I, I've always liked horses. But I would I never this is, wear this, but this I've is, always liked horses. Yeah, this is ridiculous. The hair's cool though. The hair is pretty cool. That's supposed to be the tail. All I have to say to this is nay. All I have. <laughs> I have to say this. <laughs> Kim, Kim, look over here. Look over here. How do you feel about the 2021 Met, Trip Met Gala? <laughs> <laughs> it's so fucking stupid. Frank Ocean. I think this is, um... The, his, is the doll's name is Cody? Because he Does knew. Does he know? He knew. Does Frank Ocean watch our videos? A tornado flew around the room before you came. Excuse the mess of me. That's it, yeah. Think about you. Honestly, I think him and Cody are both dressed to the nines. Everyone thought this was kind of strange. I kind of love it. I think it's cool. I think it's, awesome. I think it's cool as hell. I think it's super dope just to confuse people. To do some shit like this, and everyone's like, why does he have that? <laughs> what does it mean? And it's like, and he's like, oh, I don't know. I just. I saw this when I was walking in. Someone on the street was selling these things. Yeah, this yeah. doesn't mean anything yeah. at all. I don't know, I just kind of love it. I love that he's matching with Cody. And, and it was like a robot too. It was like moving and shit. Yeah, Cody is so cute. Kinda and that little me... robot's cute too. Oh. Gave, thank you. It would have been hilarious if the baby just started like having a temper tantrum <laughs> in the middle of the Met Gala, just crying and screaming. Really he's like, sorry, it. sorry. And he like yeah. runs out with it. Yeah. And he's like just cradling it and yeah. rocking it in the middle of the thing. Changing its diaper. Yeah, everyone's inside the gala. What is the gala? Like, do they do dinner or speeches? I think they do like performances and dinner. Okay. I don't really know, we've never been. Um. Anyway, I love this. I think it's awesome. And, and obviously he looks good and both of their outfits are, dare I say, on fleek. Yeah, I like the Prada. I mean, he's, I like the green hair. Yeah, all right, <clears throat> Timothy Chamelay. All right, we got Timothy Timely Chamelay. I like it, but the converse, I don't know, kind of throwing me off It's a kind bit. of like, okay, 
But that I guess that's Wait, American. Did I just crack the code? What? On what this is? Is this an ode to the pandemic life, where all of us were on Zoom all the time, so only the top <laughs> half was in a suit and the bottom half was in sweats? Yep, you nailed it. That's it. That could have been what he was going for. Honestly, that might be. I understand you, sweet little Timmy. Now, Kim Kardashian. This is, I think it's kind of cool, honestly. Mm -hmm. I don't know why. Is it, how is this American? I, people were saying that, like, her body has defined a lot of, like, American culture. And so she doesn't even need to show her face. People recognize her from her body. Something else like that. It's real, actually, really, if that is what she was going for, like, it's genius. And I'm kind of obsessed with it. That couldn't even, that might not even be her. I mean, it's pretty insanely genius. I think that, that, that this is cool. It is. And, you know, plastic surgery is pretty American, so... Right, and I bet I you think it's, it's I, I just think it's badass. I bet you it's comfortable. It's fucking badass to go to a event where the, its main purpose is like worshiping celebrities and mm. what they wear yeah. and like wealth. Yeah. And she's like, I don't give a fuck about the pictures. I'm just going to show up. I mean, like, obviously, obviously it's a little bit ironic yeah, yeah. because everyone's going to be talking about it, but right. I still think it's kind of cool in that way. Totally. Big ups, Kim. Um, I wonder how she ate. Jamming food into the, right into the spandex and just popping back out. <laughs> Like she leaves and it's, it's all like shit just all over. Sh like just <laughs> stained like ketchup and <laughs> she like smells like shit. <laughs> She's all stained. <laughs> Pete Davidson. I think this is sick. I think it's cool too. I mean, I think he's a very fashionable guy. I think it's like punk rock in a way. Mm. I just think it's dope. It reminds me of like Dropkick Murphys for some reason. It's like heart. It's like you know. Like if I just saw, maybe like the skin from his legs. Yeah. Up to his shoulders. Yeah. I would think it was like an elderly woman. <laughs> yep, grandma. Or like a nun. Grandma. Ooh, that's kind of cool. She kind of looks like she's on fire. She's like a little flame. She looks like um, like the Firefox. What's what's the <laughs> like logo? The Firefox logo. <laughs> <laughs> she does. Okay, let's talk about it. So this one. Let's fucking talk. This about one it. and um, ASAP Rocky's. Rocky's. Both are super dope because they're just like, I know, it's just really comfortable. Just really I'm comfy. obsessed. I'm obsessed. I love that it's like a blanket jacket, but it also is like a dress at the bottom and then like the diamonds popping out from the beanie. Yeah. I mean, it's it's so fucking good. Yeah, this is really cool. You can just drop down at any moment and go to sleep. Absolutely. And you know what? Like just tired from paparazzi shots. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Her and ASAP just like this. Cutting. On the red carpet floor, just like this. ASAP, 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 ASAP. What do you think about the Met Gala? Just, and then fucking Kim Petras walks by. And they're like, whoa! Ah! <laughs> I feel like I was there for a second. Yeah. Olivia Rodrigo. Let's talk about it. Let's fucking talk about it. This is so good. I'm obsessed with this. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I think she looks so Great. But it's not really like themed out at all. She said it was a nod to American punk music. Yeah, like I guess it's kind of like um, No Doubt, sort of Gwen Stefani style. Yeah, I just, I think she looks really good. And it's her first Met Gala and that could really go awry and it didn't. Oh, I love this one, Barbie Ferreira. It kind of reminds me of like, no, I, don't know. I don't know, 20s? Like, In a gown like, um, that made her seem Gatsby. Like sort of... Gatsby, yeah, yeah, 20s, sorry. Like, what's the word for that? Um, Flapper. Yeah, flapper. <laughs> It is, right? Yeah, flapper. Yeah, flapper. Flapper. Flapper? Barely, barely know the gal. Barely know her. Thank anyway, you. I think she looks great and, like, really stunning. And um, it's just a beautiful, beautiful... The detail? Yeah. Barbie. You look like one. Okay, Billie Eilish. It's just almost too too much. No, it's it's so I'm chic. I'm saying in a good way. It's so chic. And you know, like, she was talking about how she finally feels more comfortable with herself and her body. And so now she wants to go into this. Like, now she wants to embrace that. Yeah. And she is crushing it. And she yeah. looks beautiful. I mean, she does. She looks like a Barbie. She said, I, I saw that interview where she said she was inspired by Holiday Barbie. Mm. And like, she really looks like Holiday Barbie. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> the hair is wild. This shit's dope. I actually like it a lot. Yeah. I mean, it looks like pretzels on the top, which kind of got me a little bit hungry. Sorry, we were entranced. Okay. Jennifer. Yeah. Jennifer Lopez. I, she's like Indiana Jones. I just, um, I just, I don't know, like this style 
We've said this before so many times because it's just so hard to get away from Texas mom when you do the style. <laughs> this is like Indiana Jones. I this know, is like but Hunter. It and could I get it, like cowboys, American. Like I totally get. It. I, think it's I get it. I'm just saying theme. it could also be someone's mom at Stagecoach. Hundred percent. Hundred percent. That is a, an influencer at Coachella. It's not someone at Stagecoach. That's like a girl at Coachella. It's okay, an that's influencer true. At Coachella. That is true. Yeah, that's true. Well, I hope she wears this to Coachella with Ben Affleck this year. Yeah, I mean, she looks fucking hot. And he's, so. gonna, he's gonna be wearing sweatpants. She's dressed as Ben Affleck's back tattoo. <laughs> she looks fucking hot. I know. That's what I just said. She really How old does. Is she like sixty, like and she's still fucking killing she's it. Like fifty. She just turned like fifty-two, I think. She's like she tried to do what Billie Eilish did by coming yeah. in and trying to wow people. I mean, it's working. I'm not sure if I'd she looks say like a wow. Cake. Yeah, she does. How does it like? How does this even work? <laughs> like, where is her body? She looks like a big fountain. Because like this is the carpet down here. Like you can see through this dress. You see what I'm saying? It's oh, like what a the slinky. fuck? Oh, it's like a construction. This is it's like, like a. Does it like bounce when she? <laughs> so I'm assuming she's in there somewhere. But is she wearing stilts? Is she really tall? I don't know. This is like a, it's an optical illusion. That's what it, it is. It really is. She came dressed as an optical illusion. It not only turned heads, it cleared the floor because everyone was scared. I think because and it looks like a duster. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh shit, it's over. They're cleaning up the yeah. carpet. She comes slinking by. <laughs> Holy fuck. She's jacked. She's always had like kind of the most insane body in the world. Oh my God. And she's... It turns out that she still does. <laughs> and she, uh, <laughs> uh, I think she, she looks really good. Um, no, I mean it's kind. Of, it's I mean it's it, like actually I don't have many words. <laughs> like, did her vagina come out? Oh yeah, because she's not even wearing underwear. She's absolutely not wearing underwear. This is oh my God, weird. That's like what I look like when I like <laughs> clean, clean the, house. the house. Yes. Oh my God, Cody, that's exactly what I was about to say. <laughs> I also wear a giant dress <laughs> when I clean the house. I mean, guys. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Well, sh I think a lot of people saw the Megan Fox photo from the night before and they were like, fuck, let's switch it to whatever she did. Cody. What? You think that she saw Megan Fox the <laughs> night before the Met Gala yeah. and she copied Megan Fox <laughs> the night before the Met Gala. I don't know, that picture, that picture was fucking everywhere. I don't think Kendall Jenner has a single fuck. This is from Audrey Hepburn. Did okay. wore a dress like this. In one oh, of her Audrey interviews. Hepburn wore the dress. Not wore the exact dress, but it was like an ode to that. And I think her and Givenchy were probably planning it more than just the night before when she saw Megan Fox at the VMAs with Machine Gun Kelly fighting <laughs> Conor McGregor, Kendall was like, that's what I want to be. Yeah, she was like, holy fuck, this picture is really blowing up. <laughs> it's beautiful, it's flattering, it's, I get what she was going for, seeing like the pictures that she posted <clears throat> on her Instagram story before, I mean, I just, I really love it. I really love it. I really do. All right, get off her nuts, Jesus. Diamonds are forever! <laughs> Emma Chamberlain! Yeah, 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 yeah. I think the hair and the like the makeup is sick. The dress too. The dress is great too. It, Emma crushed it. I mean, she looks amazing. We've known Emma for a very long time, so to see her crushing it like this, proud moment yeah. for us. Yeah. It's it's ten out of ten. She she crushed it. It looks great, and uh, that's wild that she got invited to that. She did all the interviews like Liza did. Oh, nice. Yeah. Oh, cool. I know, and she did such a great job. We love you, Emma. Oh, this is sick. Kiki Palms. This is sick. I love Kiki Palmer. She was the host of the night. This kind of is my favorite one. <gasps> really? Yeah, I don't know why. It reminds me of that, like, I don't know. It's so cool. It's like sparkly chainmail. Yeah, yeah, it is. It's really stunning. And I like I the, love hair. the hair. Yeah. Wait, where's her body? <laughs> Wait, she didn't come wearing a body! Camouflage. <laughs> Camouflage. Try joke. to keep up, guys. Get in line. Try to keep up, okay? She looks good. She looks like an eagle as well. I don't really understand it. She looks like an eagle with no body. Okay. We gotta go next. Hold on, where's her body? Seriously. <laughs> Anna Wintour, at least she's got a body. Boot is so big! <laughs> what? So Anna Wintour, the lady of the night. Who's the lady of the night? Like, she's the lady of the night. What does that mean? Like, she is the editor-in-chief of Vogue. Oh, God. Vogue. I've never seen her without glasses on. She looks great. <laughs> yeah, just in we case. We love you. <laughs> just in case we ever have to be in, in, get invited. Just in case you got any extra invites laying around for next we year. We love that so dress, awesome. Anna. Awesome. Awesome. Tom Ford. Who the fuck is that? <laughs> he looks like shit. Who made his outfit? <laughs> 
Tom Ford in Louis Vuitton. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Love you, Tom. Love you, Tom. Texas bag, by the way. Yeah, dude. <laughs> I love Eva Chen. She's one of my favorite people in the world to follow on Instagram. Is this NASCAR? Is that what this is? I don't really know. It looks like NASCAR, doesn't it? It kind of does. I like it a lot. Eva I don't Chen, know why I like that, but it's like... Because you like NASCAR. Maybe that's what she was going for. I like NASCAR like an ironic way. I actually kind of like it, honestly. Evan Mock. <laughs> this one stresses me the fuck out so much. Like It's th scary. What is that? This is like the reason why I hate Halloween. Oh, shit. Ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> ah! Yeah, this is fucking freaking like, me out. This is why I don't like when people dress up for Halloween and he just did it at the Met Gala. If he was just wearing this outfit without the mask, I would think it was really, really cool. I Same. like the safety pins. I like the shorts. I think it's an awesome outfit. It just kind of scares the shit out of me. Yeah. Okay, Grimes. The sword is crazy. That was yeah. made out of an AR-15. It's like a it's project from Mischief. They take AR-15s and make them into swords instead. Okay. Which I think is kind of cool. I like that. Um. I mean, it's pretty wild. I like the mask. Like, do you think she had to get that sword like pre-approved? Probably. Like, like to bring in a full-on weapon. Just a full-on weapon. Very on the nose with the theme. <laughs> very, very on the nose. I mean, I appreciate that. And she's killing it. Yep. I mean, she said, what's the theme? She did it the night before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> she just, there's, I mean, there's no more obvious outfit you could choose, <laughs> except like dressing up like the Statue of Liberty. I feel like they should have done something with, different with the hair. Yeah. Like the pink is clashing a little bit for me. That's her thing though, isn't it? Doesn't she always have dyed hair? But she could have dyed it like red, white, and blue as well. Yeah, that's true. That is true. If she's gonna go, like, just go for it, go for it. So there you have it, folks. Another fashion review. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Remember, these are all jokes, and we don't know what we're talking about. We don't. This is just surface level impressions. Cheers. Thanks for watching, guys. USA. 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 <laughs> I don't want to do that at all. <laughs> Oh, say can you see by the dawn? He's from Canada. It's okay. Okay, bye. bye. <laughs>